Hey guys, it's Dan Ree here, and today we're going to be learning how to make a server on 1.19.2. I made a video like this a while ago, but it's pretty outdated and things have changed a little tiny bit. So I have this folder here. First, you're going to need to make a folder. You can name it anything. I just named the tutorial for this tutorial. So then you need to go to this website in your browser. This will be in the description. And then you're going to press download latest spigot. Then click that. And then once you're here, it will say downloading at one point, but you have to click here for it to download. So click there. And then wait for it to download. Once it's done downloading, you can minimize your tab and then drag it into your desktop. And then we're going to rename this, right click and press rename, we're going to rename this to just spigot. And then we're going to take this and put it in the folder that we have made. Then we're going to double click the file that we just downloaded. And then it's going to create some other folders so logs and bundler and eula and server pro properties so we're going to go in the eula and change this value to true has to be spelled exactly correctly no uppercase letters then save it and then you can go in server properties and change anything you want here like we can put the game mode in creative just have to spell everything correct enable command blocks why not put that on true and you can change literally every, everything like the MOTD we can put this on tutorial server and press save and then double click the the spigot.jar again and it will run a few things and then a file called world will pop up and all of these files over here all right our server is done booting up now we can go in minecraft and join the server by the way guys you do have to ha have java 17 installed on your computer if you want to do 1.19 servers so let's go ahead and launch minecraft 1 19.2 and test the server out all right guys we are in our minecraft 1.19 so let's go in multiplayer and then you're going to type in zero if you're hosting it on your computer and then let's join the server and see how everything is and we are in guys so i am in creative I have access to every block in the game and it's just a normal world and guys you can also import worlds in the world folder and replace it with world that you have already made so let's do that right now go to options resource packs and open pack folder once you've done this then you're going to go to dot minecraft on the top over here and then go to saves and i mean you you don't please don't question my world names but i'm going to import overweight okay that's so very weird i'm gonna copy my world called overweight and paste it in the desktop and once we've done that, you want to rename it to world. And then, I think you need to turn the server off. Yeah, you need to turn the server off right now. So to close the server, you just click 
right here and then it will shut down easier is that and then you want to delete the file called world delete it not rename it and then put your other world right in and then you can start the server up again all right guys the server's back up so let's go in minecraft press the refresh button and then join the server once again all right guys we are inside of minecraft and the server's running fine it's in my hardcore world i have all my things i'm in my village in my home there's my very trash farm don't know why he's a flesher he's supposed to be a mason right now and here's the iron golem that scouts my house the whole day my unfinished house all right guys so that is the tutorial for the day and if you have any problems with your server please tell me in the comments below have a nice day guys and bye